TSA says more are seeing uh, they are seeing more and more people not taking the correct steps when traveling with a firearm. The warning comes after a gun was taken into the airport in a man's carry on backpack in August. At the time, TSA said the wrong bag was flagged for search and the man took the gun through the airport before it was found in a bathroom trash can. News Channel 8's Alessandra Young joins us now live at Tampa International Airport with more on this story. It's a busy travel time for sure. That it is, Josh, and TSA representatives say that people cannot bring their guns through these safety checkpoints here, but they're actually seeing more and more people do this. When traveling with a firearm, you have to take certain precautions. Before you start your travel, get a hard sided case that's padded on the inside. When you're traveling with a firearm, the most important thing you need to do is you need to make sure that it is completely unloaded. That means no magazines or rounds chambered. Put everything safely inside the case except for your ammunition. That needs to be stored separately and securely away from your firearm. Make sure your case is locked. Once you get to the airport, you're going to bring that firearm directly to the airline ticket counter, and you're going to let them know that you're traveling with a firearm. They're going to give you a card to fill out. It's called a declaration card. That lets the airline and TSA know that you're traveling with a gun. Mark Howell with TSA says this year in Tampa, they've had a total of 137 firearms come through the checkpoint compared to 131 last year. This permitless carry went into effect earlier this year. You've got a lot more people carrying firearms. Uh, and with that, you're going to see more guns come to, to the security checkpoint. Howell says you can take more than one firearm in your box. As for how to get your gun when you get to your destination. Check with the airline to find out where you should pick it up. Uh, what we recommend is that if you have a firearm case like this, and it fits into your suitcase, just pack it in your suitcase. Some airlines will require you to pick up a case if it's packed separately like this from their baggage office. So check with your airline on, on how to do that. He says always do your planning and research before traveling with a weapon. If you do not declare your firearm with one of these cards, you will be subjected to a civil penalty by TSA. Live in Tampa, Alessandra Young, 8 on your side.